This is 26 Orchard Hills Parkway. It's in Orchard Hills Condominiums, which is uh, probably one of the nicest condo groups in the Bangor area. These were done in the um, mid to late 80s. They're two bedroom, one and a half baths, all individually owned. This particular owner just went through and uh, renovated. Uh, they repainted, <coughs> um, <coughs> did new countertops, new flooring, uh, and uh, appliances upgraded to stainless steel. This has got a big sort of living room, has a coat closet here as you come in. They haven't done their final clean through yet, um, <coughs> but they did finish the kitchen. So this has got a dining and then kitchen. <coughs> Notice the built-in microwave, which is an upgrade from um, the old just fan. New flat top, self-clean stove, and the Samsung um, French door fridge, which is kind of cool. Um, a little nicer than what you typically see. Uh, this also has a pantry. These were designed so they have nice storage. Built-in shelves. It's got the Backyard on these two we'll take a quick look at but this does have a half bath on the first floor So there's a bathroom on this each level first and second floor It gives you some extra countertop etc over here and there's plenty of room for a regular dining room set here That actually uh, used to go in above the toilet, but they put a new toilet in so it doesn't fit anymore So that shelving is going away, but it was in the bathroom um, These were built with electric heat which it still does have still does work, but most of these units have been switched over. So this is propane. It's got a hot air unit. Um, and <clears throat> that's uh, propane that is in the backyard. The owner pays the heat here. That's um, a little unusual. A lot of condos in our area, the tenant has to take care of their own heat. But the owner does heat this. Nice yard. It is private. has a fence there. A little storage building. Um, I think it's four by like six. Gives a little space to put um, you know, outside chairs, that kind of stuff, in the wintertime if you don't want to leave them out. Plenty of room for a grill though, um, pet friendly, so if you have a dog, it's fine. Um, the propane is behind that fence there. Um, and then um, this laminate is all new as well. Um, kind of a nice upgrade from what was here. We'll go upstairs. It does have nice um, bay window here, which I guess I could have opened up these windows a little bit. Well, um, so it does have a lot of natural light if you want. That's important to a lot of people. Again, and then a stairway, which is um, wood treads, but it's got the runner up the stairs. It's got two bedrooms plus um, a finished family room or office area on the third level. Um, it's straight ahead is the second smaller bedroom. Pretty good size. It's a kind of a darker color, but it's got a regular closet over here. It does have built-in shelving. It's also the master has got built-in shelving in this closet as well. Um, this full bath here it does come with a washer dryer and it's a fairly new set. Um, again, vanity washer has got the stainless steel inside. The um, washer and dryer um, is the only thing that's not maintained by the owner. If something goes wrong, you do have to have them serviced. He maintains all the kitchen appliances though. Again. This has the toilet with the built-in shelving for odds and ends. And it does have the storage above these two, which is cool, because it gives you a spot to put linens and that kind of thing. And then it's got a full tub shower up in this bathroom. And then the master bedroom is over here. Again, uh, the bedrooms are carpeted, which is kind of nice in our colder weather. Um, we haven't had them cleaned yet, but they will be cleaned when uh, it's rented. We do it afterwards so as we walk people through the clean carpets don't get dirty again. This is kind of neat because it does have a cathedral ceiling uh, up to that bonus third floor space. Again, good office space or computer room or um, some people just use it for storage because it does give a big area for storage. Um, master closet is over here and again has built-ins so it's got shelving. Um, rod there plus a rod there to hang long stuff and then we'll go upstairs too so upstairs here you've got again I don't know probably 15 by 20 or something like that area that you can get for storage or a lot of people do have it set up as a family room where they have an extra TV and that kind of thing it does have a couple skylights so it does get natural light up here as well 
So that completes 26 Orchard Hill Parkway. If you would be interested, let us know. It is available immediately. And then the owner does, again, take care of the heat. And he also pays the condo fee. So the lawn and snow is taken care of. A lot of tenants like that because you don't have to worry about doing snow or taking care of lawn, etc. The only <coughs> excuse me, expense basically for the tenant is um, <coughs> electric and then water and sewer. Water and sewer is pretty small, but every unit here does have its own meter. And then the cable internet. That is up to the tenant whether they have it, but if you have it, it is your expense. So that completes 26 Orchard.